sense of trepidation isn't an emotion one usually feels when driving a Porsche 911 Carrera. But this new facelifted model is different. After 53 years of stubbornly sticking naturally aspirated engines into the back of the Carrera, this new model is powered by a 3-litre twin-turbo flat six. So is it any good? Or has Porsche mucked up one of the world's most iconic sports cars? That's what we're here in Tasmania to find out. Let's start with the engine. The same basic unit powers both the Carrera and the more powerful Carrera S. And you can breathe a sigh of relief. It's still a proper Porsche engine. Its power delivery is linear, it still revs all the way to 7,500 RPM, and it's seriously fast. Acceleration for both cars has improved, and on the public road it feels rapid. It's more efficient too, of course, but a negative is the sound. It's still unmistakably a flat six soundtrack, but turbocharging has robbed the Carrera of its iconic spine-tingling exhaust note. Porsche has also tweaked how the Carrera looks, particularly at the rear, and fitted new active aero flaps in the front bar. There's also bigger tyres and brakes, and inside Porsche has added a new touchscreen with greater connectivity, and also a brilliant new sports steering wheel. So has turbocharging ruined the 911 Carrera? Hardly, but it has changed it. It's now more efficient, grippier and faster, but it's also lost some of its rawness and its naturally aspirated magic. All things considered, it's a fair trade.